Good evening, I am NateTG9, and uh, to mix things up, we're playing some Hollow Knight today. And by that, I mean, this is basically the start of a playthrough, I guess, so why am I saying it like that? Anyway, this is, as you can see, the Void Art Edition. I got this on sale for the PlayStation. It's, it's, it's a pretty nice deal, so as you can see, I've already played a little bit. Not a whole lot, really. This is Mikuru Fire is what we're here to do. Ah, oh, we gotta read. It says, In wilds beyond, they speak your name with reverence and regret, for none could tame our savage souls, yet you, the challenge met. Oh my god, reading is hard. Under Palest Watch, you taught, we changed based in six were redeemed, a world you gave to bug and beast as they had never dreamed. From the elegy for Paul. <laughs> Whatever. Reading, my worst enemy. Just kidding, of course. I used to read all the time, it's just kind of been on the backlog, so I haven't had much time to read. Anyway, we got some, some nice simple opening cutscenes here to start. It's, it's, it's pretty sick. It's uh, setting this up, I guess, for stuff I've yet to see, so that's cool. I'm gonna avoid giving my first impressions on the game because so far I haven't gotten very far and I've I only got one power up since I'm pretty sure people would refer to this as a what a metroidvania it's a, it's pretty much you you move around you get you get power ups you get to fight bosses I guess I don't know I, I don't particularly like comparing games to other games because they have a similar genre unless they're just like basically the same like every FPS ever, I guess. That's that's meant to be a joke. At least some try to be interesting and original. Not all of them, unfortunately. But what can you do? It's the world we live in, isn't it? It's all about the monies. Anyway, here we are starting off. Let's play. It's it's been a wee bit, so you'll excuse me if I take a little bit. Okay, yeah, dead end. I did skim through here just so I could uh, do some some audio level adjustment because I, I don't oh my god <clears throat> oh my god I can't even juice up I don't have a, a good setup here so I'm just rolling with whatever ends up happening I don't know so yeah I, I don't know my first impressions of this game, which I said I wasn't going to talk about, but because in all honesty, I don't know what else to say, was was a bit on the, I don't know, side. I, I watched, like, a video forever ago, and it looked pretty fucking cool, but, I don't know, maybe it just starts too simple. Maybe that's what it is. I, I got this spirit reducing ability. That's, that's great, right? You never, never die, but... Because it took me so long to beat the first boss, I, I I didn't have any sort of actual ability for the longest time. I don't know, maybe, maybe that was a problem. It was, it was my fault. Yeah, that's it. It's definitely my fault. But anywho, it's, uh, yeah, oh my god. I guess you could say this game appealed to me because it, it was something that I hadn't played in a while. You know, it's it's got, it's got platformy stuff. And uh, as of late, I've kind of had a falling out with the genre, at least... With uh, the Mario games, so those, those are the ones I played growing up, and my god, I just can't enjoy them anymore. Like, maybe it's just the the recent 2D entries that were kind of just meh. <clears throat> if you seen any on the 3DS? You you probably know what I'm talking about, huh? Maybe I screwed it up. Thought I was supposed to get extra health. No, oh, there we go. Eesh. It's been a while, okay? It's been like two weeks. I've, I've been I've been too excited to play Neo, and you know I can't do that anymore. The internet's kind of not working. I've got a guess on what the problem is, but as of right now, I haven't really done anything about it. So, yeah, that's probably one of the main reasons I was on my PC just <laughs> playing some some uh, Star Tropics. Well, we'll get back to that tomorrow or something. If there's no interest in this, maybe I'll just say fuck it and never do it again. It's one of those games I. I feel a little better just playing on my own because I honestly don't know what to do for commentary. Maybe it's just these these uh, style of games where you kind of have to have some focus or something. I, I, I don't know. <clears throat> but 
But if you do enjoy platformy, action -y games, you, you should you, that have like maybe okay commentary and well, it's it's got some bad audio going on and uh, I can't really say much for the video quality. I did watch through the first part or two a little while ago. And it's, it's actually pretty good. Check out that my Faxandu or Fazandu playthrough. Maybe I'll link it. But I gotta read. Hold that, traveler. I'm afraid there's only me left to offer welcome. Our town's fallen quite, you see. The other residents, they've all disappeared. I headed down that well one I mean, I headed. <coughs> headed down that well one by one into the caverns below. Used to be there was a great kingdom beneath our town. It's long fell to ruin. Yet it still draws folks into the depths, or into its depths. God, I fucking can't read. Wealth, glory, enlightenment. That darkness seems to promise all things. I'm sure you too seek your dreams down there. I'm changing my voice for this character every second. Well, watch out. It's a sickly air that fills the place. Creatures turn mad. And travelers are robbed of their memories. Perhaps dreams aren't ha, such great things after all. Thank you, sir. I'm gonna go sit on this bench and lose my health. Yay! I didn't need to do that. Just a checkpoint, I guess. Okay. No point going over the well. There's a locked door. Just uh, for the curious, it's. I'm pretty sure what's over there. It's uh, It's been a hot sec, but I'm pretty sure that was. Uh, pretty sure that's what it is. There you go. Anyway, as I was saying, this game starts out pretty slow because a lot of these enemies are pretty standard because, as you can probably surmise, my moveset just amounts to moving, jumping, and up, down, slash. It's like Zelda 2 if, you know, you actually started with the up and down slash, which, you know, you don't. <laughs> <clears throat> Though, to be fair, that was uh, more of a locking dungeons and stuff behind learning a skill type dealy. It kind of worked. And this is kind of mandatory for combat, just being able to attack in all directions, I guess. I don't know. I'm not very good at it, which is probably one of the main reasons I kind of haven't played a whole lot of it. It's all, it's all about timing with your down slashes, and I just, I just don't got that. Hmm, my, hello there. Come down to explore these beautiful old ruins. Don't mind me. I have fondness for exploring myself, getting lost and finding your way, <coughs> and finding your way again to. <laughs> my God, I was trying to cover up my absolute screw up there with reading, but it didn't work. I screwed it up again. Okay, let's start from the start. Getting lost and finding your way again is a pleasure like no other. We're exquisitely lucky, you and I. I'm a cartographer by trade, and I'm working on mapping this area right now. Would you like to buy a copy of my work so far? Heck yeah, boy, I'll do that. <coughs> a view a detailed map of hollowness in the map. Blah, pain of the inventory. Pain, what is it? Um, glass? Chocolate. Is it glass? A map can be a useful thing, but alone it won't show you where you are. If you're not the head, blah. If you're not the head for direction, I suggest you purchase a compass from my wife, Zelda. Or however you say that. She's just now opening our new shop in Dirtmouth. Selling all sorts of useful things to wanderers like yourself. She'll even sell some of my old maps from time to time. I pop back to see her whenever I finish mapping the area. She's always so excited to see me. Okay, we got ourselves a map and there's the boss. I guess we're gonna go this way to get to it. This is the roundabout way, but because I had to go talk to that dude... Fuck was that? Um, I kinda had to go down here in the first place. I could've gone back up, but... Oh, is this one of those, you gotta kill the monsters to prog- Oh my god! To progress type of scenarios. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go with that, uh, maybe? May oh my god, there's so many of them. At least these ones don't- Oh, god damn it, I suck at this game. Ah! Get over here! You like the squishy mages from Agra, Sankey. I can't get you without wasting like 20 turns, and then that screws me over for the story. That's pretty bad. All of zero people are gonna get that reference. <laughs> it's been obscure. Hell yeah. 
Maybe, maybe I'll get back to playing that game. Um, I guess technically it's kind of a, a spin-off entry, but, you know, it's still an entry nonetheless, and I was having some fun with this. Is, is this a hot spring or is this death? Oh, heck yeah. And there's a bench. I actually haven't discovered this area. That's cool. A bit unnecessary, really, but that's pretty cool. I like the backgrounds in this game. <laughs> They're really charming. Honestly, though, uh, I was going to mention this earlier, but I originally thought maybe I could stream this game. But when I actually started playing it and seeing the visuals, I realized uh, it's probably not possible. My internet's kind of shit, so it's pretty much out of uh, the realm of possibility. So that's why I'm just doing this. I honestly should check the time before starting. I figured I'd just beat the first boss, but I'm uncertain about how long that'll actually take. It could take... Um, Anywhere from, I don't know, from now to, you know, uh, quite some time, because I might die to the boss, and that'd just be straight up embarrassing, but it's possible. It actually took me a while to figure out how the heck I'm supposed to beat it, so it's pretty basic, but I am sure I might die. <coughs> we'll find out, though. That's, uh, that's where the fun comes from, doesn't it? Can't get up there yet. Gotta deal with these guys. Don't know what their deal is, but... Okay. Um, yeah. Cool. Um, I should be over there. I, I pointed out, but... I don't know if pointing it out would actually help. Uh, yeah, okay. No, this isn't the way, but I'm gonna check what's here. I can't remember. I think it's just a... A chair. Okay. I thought it was a collectible or something. What's Inspect. Machine with a symbol of a stag. Insert Geo. I don't know if this is a permanent unlock or... Wait. Guess it is. Damn, I should have done that. <laughs> My last file I was like, no, this costs too much. I'm poor as shit. So I kind of ignored it. I was buying all the mapping stuff. So, you know me. Gotta, gotta, gotta grind for everything. That's why it took me so long to get to the boss. Not that uh, what you get from the boss is overly amazing. It's uh, pretty cool. It's got, well, uh, we'll see when we get there, but it's pretty nice, basically. I like it. it, it as I said, it kind of reminds me of Faxana do to an extent, where um, you get a bunch of money from the king and you can decide how to spend it, but there's a, uh, oh shit, fuck. But there's a... Uh, a glitch in the game where if you have no money, he'll just give you money again. You just have to re-listen to his entire story monologue, which is okay, I guess. It, it takes a little bit, but basically, yeah, you, you can get as much money as you need for all the items, where it kind of intends you to just grab what you can and move on, but... <clears throat> Nifty game, by the way. I love that game. If, you, if you've never heard of it, you should, you should really check that out. Uh, I'll probably link the playlist, and if I, if I don't, you can probably find it fairly easy. I, I don't actually have a whole lot of games that I've actually played, mostly because, I don't know, maybe it's the summer always driving me freaking crazy. I haven't, I always end up having a really inconsistent upload schedule. But, yeah, that was, that was a fun time. That was, that was a good game. Okay, boss man, here he is. He's kind of wearing armor. He's Okay, I guess. It took me a little bit to figure out his techniques. They're, they're they're pretty simple, really. But you know, you gotta you gotta dodge and stuff. It's it's pretty awkward early on because all you got is um, movement, and that that shockwave comes out after a slight delay. So it's it's honestly a little bit weird for me to dodge, but I've gotten the gist of it. I've I've played this enough. I got it. <laughs> Yeah, I'd be pretty upset, too. I mean, the whole reason I'm wearing armor is to keep myself from dying, isn't it? <laughs> Didn't go over so well, did it? <clears throat> oh no, he's cornered me! What do I do? Guess I'll just <laughs> whack him still. <clears throat> I don't know, I think I'm doing pretty good. Last time I took a bunch of hits, like, right off the bat. But the game generally gives you enough time to heal. With this guy, at least, but... I don't know. 
it, it's it's the the next guy you have to fight that really got me. He he was pretty intense. I kind of sucked. <laughs> Hopefully, when we get to that, I won't suck so much. Oh yeah, got him. Come get some, boy. I don't even know what this guy's supposed to be, but I'm gonna assume he's just pretending to be a dude that's a bug by wearing armor. What he is, who he is, what he's about, I don't know, but he's pretty funny. Also, I should, I should keep track of how many hits it takes to kill him, because that's not really useful information, but it, it might be insightful for me, you know. Because he's a boss. Knowing how many times you gotta hit him to make him fall over is pretty much key. This isn't Zelda. You don't gotta throw a bomb in a Dongo's mouth and he'll die or let you hit him. Nah, that's that's it's not that easy. You gotta whack him with that s stick. Ow, that was unintentional. My bad. No perfect run. Damn it. I wasn't expecting a perfect run anyway, but eh. Let me just juice up here. Don't mind me. Wait for me, friend, and he's he's gone. Let me just finish him off then. Oh, he sounds he sounds sounds so sad whacking him. I feel really bad killing this guy. Da -da. You okay, bud? You okay? <laughs> um, um, what's this? I didn't see this last time. God, I'm a fucking idiot. I'm missing all the shit. City crest. What is that? Will I be able to come back and get that? Because I, I definitely know I missed that. I'll have to check. Uh, it'll involve backtracking, but I have to check that. That's that's important. I'm actually kind of glad I'm doing a second playthrough, even if it's kind of behind, and I who knows if I'll finish it. It definitely does help with uh, finding new shit, which is ironic since most Let's Play type shit, you end up missing more stuff than you find, but hey, what can I say? I guess I'm the opposite. <laughs> Every so often that happens, right? <clears throat> Investigate the building! I've already missed some people... whatever. <coughs> Hello, sir. Oh, who's that cre cre creeping out of the darkness? My, you're looking grim. Strange empty face and a wicked looking weapon. Something important has drawn you down into Hollow Nest's corpse. But I won't ask what. Perhaps the reason you found me is because you need my help. Snail Shaman. <laughs> okay. Say no more, friend. I'm going to give you a gift. A nasty little spell of my own creation. It's just perfect for a little one like you. Ho 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 ho. <clears throat> Excuse me. Oh, check it out. It's an alien head. Just pretty sick. Or maybe not. Don't be afraid. Have faith. That spell belongs to you now. All you need to do is take it. If only magic were so easy. Oh, ho, ho, you won't be going much further without it. I promise you. Fine. Whoop, 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 whoop. And then we eat it. And then we die. Hooray! Death. I guess not something we should be cheering about. But vengeful spirit. To unleash the spirit. Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> Basically, I guess we've been possessed. Who can say? And that's why we can shoot it out like a gun and go, Pow! It's pretty sick. I like it. Oh, I had to actually get up. Hello, friend. No, 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 no. Oh, you've awoken at last. I apologize. Perhaps I should have warned you about the power of that spell. I was watching over a <laughs> you as you slept. But... S seem to have slipped away myself. Oh, 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 wow, I can't even talk. Now, we are awake. I was wondering whether you would do me a small favor. Not as repayment for my gift, of course. Simply because we are now friends. You see, a horrid great beast has made its home in the heart of this temple. Such disrespect! I would be quite grateful if you were to venture deeper in and slay it for me. It's a hardy creature, but with your new power, you're more than a match for it. Good luck with a small favor, my friend. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Merry Christmas, I guess. <clears throat> now, what is it? Are you wondering about this gate between us? Oh, ho, it's a curious thing, but this door will not open until you have slain that creature lying in the heart of the temple. 
Yeah, I've already encountered these. Don't worry about it. I'm sure the spirits of my ancestors will be watching over you. Oh, so that's what that is. Your ancestors. I'm not wasting my vengeful spirit on a mook. Come on, what am I? <clears throat> Clearly not a strategist who realizes that when I hit an enemy with my super awesome cool weapon, I recharge. No, no, of course not. Why would I do why would I know that? That's that's absurd. Who would who would ever figure that out? It's it's so complex. It's 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 just an advanced technique. You'll you'll never figure it out. It's impossible. It can't be done. Of course I'm exaggerating, of course. But uh yeah. I guess this is the way. I did this not too long ago, and oh my god, I still forgot about these damn ball dudes. Fucking ball dudes. Kicking my ass. <clears throat> Excuse me. As you can clearly tell, I suck. See, look, he's right there. I haven't noticed him on multiple occasions, but I got him this time. Yeah, it takes a little bit more concentration sometimes than others. Early on, I was just like, let's do this. This is pretty easy. Then I encounter these guys and gotta watch for them and time your hits. It's a... Uh, a bit trickier for this scrub like me. <laughs> Maybe I'm just losing track of him in the background too. Who knows? That's my excuse. Okay. I think this way is okay. There's a juicer. Um, I don't need that right now. I don't know if this is the way I'm supposed to go. I can't remember. I know there was a side area here that gave uh, an extra health bonus, which is pretty sick. Eh. Don't don't touch me. As he does that multiple times. Great. I love it. I gotta juice up again. Mm -hmm. Well, I guess there's... Yeah, there's extra health here. It's sick. <clears throat> there's also that uh, energy thing, which is pretty sick. I'll, I'll grab that when I get the chance. Come forth! Yay! Fully juiced. Give me some more. And we're good. And I think we're up to the boss now. We got we got two extra HP. There he is. Spam him a bunch. Now we're out of magic. And he's gonna shoot at me. Ah! Perfect aim. Nicely done, guy. Just brilliant. Wow. That's how weak he is, God. I had so much trouble with him before. How did I how did I let that happen? What was this? Another item. Collected a charm, soul catcher. Oh yeah, okay, I've already gotten this one. I don't know what that other thing I got was, but I got this thing. That's pretty sick. And open. <clears throat> oh, so it's done then. You've slain the beast. The poor thing, it must have been terrified of you. It used to be quite docile, but the rancid air in these caverns filled it with some ancient rage. Still, you did what you had what had to be done. You have my gratitude. Of course. We both know you wouldn't have made it through without that spell of mine. Ho ho ho. And look, the gate between us has opened. I'm sure you're eager to move on. Farewell and have faith. Whatever you seek, it will find you. Oh. Why do you hesitate? You'll get nothing more from me, I'm afraid. Though I do admire your persistence. Ho 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 I like that guy. Okay, so the way out is I actually have no freaking clue where I am. So let's just go this way. And we're back. Cool. I'm pretty sure we're basically back anyway. I just want to quickly go buy some trinkets and we'll... Is this? We'll cut it short there for now. Sorry I missed you. If you're feeling lost, why not pop into our store in Doth Mount and purchase a map of this area. Available now for excellent price. Oh, so that's basically just telling you that if you missed him and beat the boss, he'll be at the st you'll be able to buy the map at the store. Which is sick, but I didn't miss him, so... I guess that's not a big deal for me. Anyway, I didn't really get to show off how sick the spirit is. I just kind of used it on the boss guy, but it's got a lot of impact. It's got a it's got a nice sound to it. It's got some sick visuals, and it kills most base level bugs in a single hit. Pretty rad. Who says rad? I just did. Either way, it's pretty sick, and I like it. <clears throat> it's very impact impactful, ineffectful. So yeah, I don't know. It's just a shame it took me so long to get it originally. <laughs> it's it's pretty awesome. 
Da, 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 da. Do, 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 do. I don't know if I'll be able to buy everything. I kind of was hoping I'd have enough currency, but at, at best I'll be able to buy the bare bones stuff, like markers for benches, maybe for people, and uh, the medallion so I can... I can see... Oh god, I did it again! I keep doing this. Why doesn't it pop me up on the other side? Maybe if I do it like this. Maybe it's based on which side. Oh, ho, 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 look at that, it is. <coughs> anyway, here's the shop. <coughs> the first shop. The only shop. <sighs> Bar for nada. Come to my map, have you? It's really my husband you should be dealing with, but what a surprise. He's headed down below. He'll pop back occasionally to deliver new maps for the store, but I do wish he'd spend a little more time up here. I'm not much interest in retail myself. Now, let's see what's here for me to sell. We got the, the Wayward Compass. That's pretty useful. We want the Quill for sure. <coughs> Excuse me. I would like the bench marker and stuff. <coughs> God, sorry. But I don't think it's really necessary. As for right now, though, I feel like the compass is pretty goddamn useful. It, uh, it'll show me where I am on the map. That's pretty sick. I just have to go equip it first. Burp, burp, burp. Map updated. To equip charms, press this button. So yeah, we got the, the wayward compass, takes up one slot, and we got the soul catcher, which takes up two. It's pretty useful. Uh, but anyway, uh, that's it for now. This is almost as far as I got. I did explore the next area a wee bit. But for right now, I think this is a good place to stop. I feel like with a game like this, I kind of have to have a bit more familiarity with the areas, the enemies and stuff to make even a remotely interesting and generically shit commentary while playing. So, we'll leave it here. Thanks for tuning in. And good night. Bye and whatever. God, I gotta get consistent with this. Anyway, bye.